for what it, whatever it's worth, here's my message to anyone who's planning on carrying out another attack. I've lived in London on and off for 15 years. I can tell you firsthand, this shit never works. It never works. London has seen attack after attack after attack, each with the aim of driving us further apart. And you know what happens? Londoners just band together. You know what happened yesterday? Strangers talked to each other on the tube. They smiled at police officers. They were actually kinder to Muslims. You're achieving the opposite of what you want, you fucking idiots. <laughs> and not just in the capital, you've managed to do something that no one in the history of Britain has ever done. You made the rest of the UK feel sympathy for London. <laughs> You didn't even shut London down. You know what the top trending topic was the day after the attack? National Puppy Day. <laughs> You've got no fucking idea how to shut this city down. And the terrorists should know that the only people who have ever had the city on lockdown are blue. <laughs> <laughs> and they did it. <laughs> right. Unless... Unless you're going to have your system up with the top down, don't even bother. And also, the only thing that would shut down London yep. is inclement weather. <laughs> yes, yes, if you really want to stop this city, buy 30 snow machines, place them around town and turn them on at the same time. <laughs> Gather up a shitload of leaves, dump them on the railway tracks and watch the havoc begin. But d don't tell us you're doing it, though, because Londoners will quite happily get ridiculously annoyed over the tiniest thing as long as it's on our terms. There's no way we'll do it if we think it's what you want us to do. <laughs> and to the guy who did this, here's what you achieved this week. You killed four people. You injured dozens more. And when you get to your God, who, incidentally, is also our God, he's probably going to have a few issues with that. If you're looking up at us right now, because there's no fucking way you're looking down, <laughs> wondering what effect you had on the people of Great Britain, let me summarise. No-one is scared. People are resilient. We think you're an idiot. You're dead. And even your God thinks you're a dick. <laughs> You said you wanted to do a play because you found uh, touring and doing stand-up very lonely. Very lonely. Are you it's joking? Very, yeah, yes. Oh, it's your tour no. support. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I found it lonely and depressing. <laughs>